Hollywood industry and the media have so much power and so much influence that even the truth movement is still being conditioned along the lines of what the mainstream media is calling popular and successful. It's amazing how Hollywood, let's just write others, even agencies, use a, uh, a spiritual tact in order to control whatever works, they'll use it. If you're a faith-filled person, they'll use that faith as a way to try to control. You're told things that, you know, you'll have the easiest of life. Basically, you made it. You're one of the 1%. They actually say that. So you have a cross connection between religion, politics, agencies, Hollywood and federal government agencies, mafia, uh, religious right. They're all connected in a one world mentality based on success, power and pleasure. You are trapped. You are owned. If you do not do exactly what they want, you will lose everything. If you are singled out by the elite and you were groomed to be part of the elite as a leader, they're going to mock you publicly and they're going to do it as an inside joke. What Spielberg did in Minority Report, Tom Cruise's character, Captain John Anderton, my dad's name and rank in the Navy, was going to be put away because his son, Sean, was murdered. In Saving Private Ryan, what are the names of the ones that are killed, the boys, the sons? Sean and Daniel. Sean is my son. Kirk Daniel is my other son. This is not an accident. Spielberg is doing this in film after film after film. 